Hey, Summit, this is Edward. You know this guy, Jake. And this is your New, New Year's Weekly Update. I actually had somebody Sunday say they missed uh us not doing one last week, really? which I found interesting. Somebody is actually anticipating. So they're one of the eight? They're anticipating these videos. One of the eight. That is crazy. I know. I know. Uh, well, it's a new year, yeah. and uh, we're excited about the new year. There's a lot of things coming up. Uh, uh, so why don't we hit a few announcements of, about what's coming. I know we've got our men's group that's starting in February. Okay. You guys that were a part of that on the Tuesday morning yeah. should have received a text. I got the text yesterday. Uh, so be looking forward to that. Uh, we're going to do a semester of story, uh, having men come in and share their stories and got some exciting stuff going on there. So it's going to be good stuff. Uh, we've got youth ministry starting. We've got children's ministry. Jake, talk a little bit about that. So the Wednesday night stuff will start back. Our students... 6th through 12th grade will start back Wednesday, uh, January 10th. So that's this coming Wednesday, no matter when you're watching this video. The Kid Picture Kids, though, they won't start until January 24th. So make sure you're staying plugged in to youth ministry, children's ministry. Uh, be checking your emails. Uh, make sure that we have your email so that we can get you know content out to you. So those two things will be kicking off. Uh, we'll be relaunching small groups towards the end of January, um, so that'll be kicking back off. And of course, like Celebrate Recovery, they run every week. They Grief, never take a day off. Cancer off. support. Grief, those, second yeah. Sunday of the month. Women Facing Cancer, fourth Sunday of the month. Uh, intro to Summit, formerly known as Membership, fourth Sunday of the month. So just kind of getting back into the swing of things with yeah. the new year. Everybody's back in the office. Took the tree down last night, the Christmas we tree. We took ours down at our house, too. No, mine's still up at my house. I'm just saying up there at the foyer. Oh, yeah, we took ours down last yeah. night. So, yeah, we're ready. 2024 is here. It's good. You know, you say it's just back to routine, just back to what we normally do, but it's really a part of our culture. It's, it's who we are, Summit. It's who you are um, as a church that we do things every week, and we do things because we want to connect people to God and others. Uh, I've been talking over the last... Uh, Last week, and I'm coming back this week, this last week, we were talking about uh, love God with all your mind this year. Yep. And part of that is just training your mind and thinking of your mind. We have a choice to love God with uh, all your obedience this year, your contentment this year. Uh, and this Sunday, I'm going to be talking about the other two, our partnership oh, and our words. Right. Uh, our words matter. Yeah. I, I, I was I, last night. I was, hey, you forgot obedience. You also said we're loved up with our obedience. Did I? I forgot obedience. Yeah, the O word. Uh, I know. Nobody I likes the O word. Nobody likes that. Um, I was I was praying last night. I had a hard time sleeping last night because there is a lot going on. We're looking for a new youth pastor. That's so, right. Um, re, kind of revamping our student ministry and got some exciting things. I just came out of a meeting yeah. there and uh, got a gathering this Sunday and. Uh, just with all the things that's going on, sometimes I get overwhelmed. And mm. so last night I was just uh, praying and I was asking the Lord, uh, you know, to give me rest and that kind of stuff. And the Lord took me to a passage uh, in 1 Samuel where the children of Israel, and this is interesting, they were, uh, they were asking God, we want a king. We want oh, yeah, a king, yeah. we want a king, we yeah. want a king. And so uh, God was reminding them that he was their king and that he was fighting their battles. And listen, though. Uh, and they just kept coming back. We want king, yeah, we king. And God listen. even warned them yeah. and said, "Hey, this is what the king will do." And they didn't first, listen. And the first king that was put in place was a terrible king. Second king was dead. They didn't and listen. And it just went on and on and on. Um, and and it just reminded me last night that even when I feel overwhelmed, mm -hmm. uh, we think about uh, our circumstances. We've been talking about in Philippians, and we were talking about just no matter what comes at us, when we feel overwhelmed, that we have a Father yeah. that that is already defending us and already taking care of us. It's our responsibility to rest in that. Mm -hmm. And that was, I was reading in there this morning, uh, early, uh, just because he woke me up last night about give me a king, give me a king, give me a king, give me a king, when we already have a king. And and our responsibility this year is just to submit to that. Mm -hmm. um, and that's just been on my mind all morning and all my meetings and all my phone calls. My first phone call started at 7.30 this morning. And uh, just all the things that's been going on today, the Lord's just remind me, I'm your king. I can trust him. I can rest in him. But even when I feel overwhelmed, uh, he, he's our king. That's a good word. And so, uh, uh, Summer, I love you. I, I told you over the last three or four weeks, you're my crown. You're my joy. I love you. And... Uh, 
I'm excited about this year. I'm gonna I get emotional uh, just thinking about what God's gonna do. Uh, that we we try to keep things as simple as possible here at Summit in our DNA, so that you have time to love on people, be in the community, and uh, I, I love you. I'm thankful for that. What else we got, bud? Man, that's it. I'm just ready to get going. Summit, we love you. Uh, make sure you share this with all your platforms. And uh, also, just to let you know, coming soon, we're working on a new events page for our website that you'll be able to go there, find everything you need for every event that's coming up for the year. Uh, hopefully, in the next couple of weeks, uh, we'll be talking more about that, but trying to get things really, really, really simple. Children, youth, small groups, service, everything we do will be on one page for you to go click. It's like the big, big red box on channel on, seven. On the KLTV. Yeah, they don't need box. a website. They just need, they just big need the red big red box. box. So um, just a simple way for you to do that. Uh, we love you. Invite somebody to be with you this Sunday. It's a new year. They may even say yes. Uh, just invite them yeah. to come. Uh, and that. So we love you. Uh, share this on your platforms. See you Sunday. Thank you.